think all the people who live in Shamron and Yehuda and the hilltops and, and in East Jerusalem and all these places, I find they're very brave and they're very special Jews, very special people, and we owe them a debt of gratitude. Because if it wasn't for them, then um, we wouldn't have all these places. executive directors of Americans for Safe Israel and uh, you know this is probably our 51st trip because for 25 years we've been running these uh, these uh, missions these Kizuk missions we go to Judea and Samaria we go to Yitza we go to Amona we go to Itamar we go to Shiloh Ailey uh, Nativa Vault, we were there yesterday. Uh, Elazar. Nafsi comes not once a year, but a few times a year, makes missions. And every Chaye Sara. And I just had any federation. And that's not something you would expect here. Wow. A federation. From where? From where? A federation group oh, coming to Hebron and being so supportive. Yes. They have tears and eyes. And maybe the first uh, words that I will say to you over here, you see what is written on the uh, on the signs, the Shavu Banim Lekvulam Bet Rachel and Bet Leach. Yeah, they're all following me on Twitter and they're lovely, lovely people and they really care about Israel, true Zionists. And uh, I just hope my English will cut it. We come קדושת הרצון ומסירות הנפש אשר נספו במערכה הכבדה. יהיו גיבורי מלחמות ישראל, עטורי הניצחון, חתומים בלב ישראל לדור לדור. Coming in from the north, and as I get to about this point, we're already, we're already I'm starting to see the bodies on the road and watching as the soldiers coming out of this building are getting hit. <laughs> Thank you for coming to Israel. How do you feel about the 7th anniversary of Israel? I'm feeling very great, excited, blessed at the same time, happy to be part of the celebrations. I understand this is the 70th anniversary and it's really awesome. Thank you so My much. My name is Lilian. I'm from Zambia. Places that I have not been to um, in Israel, and I think there are two words that kind of personify how I feel. Um, I'm going to reduce it to two words, and that's love and pride. I feel so proud. I'm very excited to see Ariel and Amar. I'm very excited to see everything that's going on in Israel because this place is inspiring. People, the, the people are so full of life that uh, I don't even know how to describe it. This has been a life-changing experience for me.
Oh, <laughs>